Just to start with you, first of all, Cup, how's it going? Uh, it's going amazing. It's really a special time to be here with all of the other nations, and it, it's yeah, it's great. It's awesome so far. Can you tell us a bit, a bit about your games so far, like how how they've gone? Yeah, the first game we uh, had England over on field five over the back, and that was a pretty special moment to be playing first World Cup and uh, great privilege to captain my country for the first time as well. Um, and yeah, we've had uh, another couple of pool games which have been great and we played um, Wales this morning which was a tough match and we've got Jersey uh, this afternoon and then New Zealand again tonight which will be, uh, which will be a tough one. How much are you looking forward to the New Zealand game? Oh, I can't wait. It's been really great playing against the other nations but I really can't wait for the New Zealand game tonight. It's going to be tough, it's going to be physical and I just can't wait for it. You had your captain's breakfast a couple of days ago. Can you tell us a bit about just your interaction with the other um, countries and how good it's been to meet them all? It was, um, it, was a, it was a long time coming. We've been emailing um, for about four, probably three or four months now um, and to get most of them together, there were a few that couldn't make it. We probably got 15 or 16 captains to the breakfast and the breakfast was uh, phenomenal and then there was a little um, there was a little episode after the breakfast where I tried to drop three or four of the guys back and took the TFA car and uh, managed to somehow put the wrong fuel in it and we got stuck in the middle of a busy street in Scotland and double-decker bus behind and the boys had to get out and wheel it and had to wait for a while but now the breakfast was amazing, it was just a little bit disappointing afterwards. Um, Nathan Jones mentioned in one of his um, captain stories that you guys have been doing a bit of training together. Um, can you tell us a bit about that? Yeah, well, Jonesy injured himself at NTL uh, or Elite Eights this year, so we had to do some alternative training. We did a bit of swimming, um, and he mentioned that my backstroke looked like an octopus falling out of a tree, which is probably incorrect. My freestyle is pretty good. My backstroke is actually better than my freestyle, but to be honest with you, like I'm so glad that we finished swimming because if I ever have to see Nathan Jones in a pair of his customised Spank Speedos again, seriously, I'd rather have carpet burn than see him in his pair of Speedos again. It was just, oh, it scared me. The big white polar bear coming out of the change rooms is ridiculous, but it was good training with him, but seeing him in his Speedos just, it, oh, it scares me. I don't even want to think about that again, actually. Sorry. How much are you looking forward to the next couple of days? Yeah, the next couple of days are going to be great. We get to the business end of the tournament. Um, and there's going to be some really tough matches against some tough nations and yeah so we're uh, as a team we're really excited